And this is just a quick video to help folks understand uh, loading dose. So loading dose is, in English terms, the amount of drug that you give a patient to achieve a certain concentration in the blood. So you would know in advance that in order to get the effects you want, you need X concentration in the blood. And this just helps you figure out how much of that drug should I give. So loading dose, as it says here, uh, right here, is equal to the volume of distribution times the desired plasma concentration over bioavailability. Bioavailability. So uh, let's break that down a little bit. Volume of distribution is a great term because it describes exactly what it is. Volume of distribution is the amount of volume over which the drug kind of disperses. So if it's a very, 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 say, hydrophilic drug and it's going to stay stuck right there in the blood, it's not going to go out into fat. It's not going to store itself in tissues and tendons and bones and wherever else. That will have a very low volume distribution. Whereas on the other hand, if we have something that's super hydro, uh, hydrophobic and it's small, it can easily diffuse places, that's going to have a large volume of distribution. So that's what that physical concept describes. The desired plasma concentration, like we mentioned, is the concentration of drug you're trying to achieve in the blood. And then finally, the bioavailability, it helps one to understand when you give a drug, not all of it becomes available to the body. Some of it is going to be passed, some of it can't be absorbed for whatever reason. That's sort of a more uh, deep pharmacology concept, which is not super in scope for the US MLE. Uh, so when we're doing this calculation, we're just looking for that bioavailability, which might also be given as the, uh, the variable F. So what we would do is take 100 liters, which we said was the volume of distribution, multiply that by our desired target plasma concentration, which is something we might have highlighted here in the question stem. And then we divide all of that by half, which is the same as multiplying it by 2. And that is going to equal 200 milligrams because 100 times 1, liters cancel out, um, times 2 is 200 milligrams. And that would be the amount of drug you would give to achieve a plasma concentration of 1 milligram per liter. That is loading dose.